Hello, welcome to Music Motors and you join me in Morocco where I'm here for the launch of the new Ford Ranger Raptor. Obviously the F-150 Raptor has been a huge success for Ford and they've said we need something for our European buyers, something that's a little bit more fuel efficient. So they've got this, this being the Ranger Raptor, instead of having a V8 which you'd have on the F-150, has a 2 litre diesel which produces 213 PS, 500 newton metres of torque. It's been raised, it's wider, it's longer. It has bigger, beefier wheels with specifically designed BF Goodrich tyres which perform well on-road and off-road. The interior has had further refinements to ensure that whilst you're going to be going off-road and putting it through its paces, you're going to be held in your seat. Massively, massively comfortable seats which grip you for days. A very comfortable and well-designed cockpit interior with decent space in the back. Now Ford currently have the market share of about 30% of pickup trucks in UK and inside Europe so for them they want to fully dominate and you can see how it's going to be quite easy with this. This is £47,000 on the road which by no means is cheap but when you consider the option of buying a normal range of wild track and converting it into something like this all of a sudden it becomes cost effective because this is going to be under manufacturer warranty and there's no denying the off-road capability of this. You've got your different mode selectors including Baja mode. And I'm not kidding when I say sand is nothing for this. You don't really get bogged down and if you do, there's no struggle getting out because of the rear diff, lock it and you're out. On-road driving capability wise, it feels very, very solid and very capable. It's definitely wider, noticeably wider than a standard Ranger but not so much so that you can't drive it on a public road. But don't worry, if you do end up being a little bit too wide for the road, it's a proper off-roader, so you can just uh, divert. Off-road capability is just uncomprehendable. There isn't a standard uh, pickup truck on the market which I believe can do what this can do. This is gonna change the segment entirely. Ford are the first people to change the pickup segment really in Europe. The Wild Track was a very, very robust and great commercial vehicle. This takes it back home. This makes it that you've got a pickup truck to use during the week, to use during the night, to use during the weekend. This is a go anywhere, do anything type of vehicle. So what Ford have done is created a vehicle which from the outside looks amazing. From the inside gives you all the amenities you could ever ask for and from a mechanical point of view it has amazing steering feel, it gives you plenty of feedback. It has amazing pedal feel when there isn't sand all over the discs. It's a vehicle which is unstoppable on road or off road no matter what you do. If you go off road and go in the sand you're going to have fun. If you go in the mud you're going to have fun. If you're on the beach you're going to have even more fun. Put it in Baja mode, turn traction control off, you're going to be sliding around having the time of your life. From the inside point of view it never got too noisy. The sound system sounded great the seats held you in that they're massively comfortable it is definitely a little bit taller but you don't notice it too much and from a driving point of view it doesn't feel like a vehicle of its size Ford have absolutely nailed it in every single way I love the standard Ranger I love a wild track but I think the Raptor is my new favorite